Hello everyone, it's Dr. Narapund here. We just received news that Brock Purdy underwent UCL repair of his elbow. Here's a quick breakdown of what this means in terms of return to play timelines, what is done during the procedure, and what are the steps for rehab. But the first important thing to understand is that ulnar collateral ligament is a thick band of tissue on the inside part of the elbow. It basically is the ACL of the elbow and gives stability to the elbow, particularly during throwing motions. It's particularly important for throwing athletes. Now there are basically three main treatment options when a UCL is injured, particularly when it's a complete tear. Number one is non-operative treatment. This is particularly done for non-throwing athletes who have a stable elbow. Number two, it's a UCL repair where basically the ligament is of good quality and is either torn off bone or torn near the bone and can be sewn together and reattached to the bone and then augmented with something called an internal brace, which is a strong suture material that allows quicker motion and gives increased strength to the elbow. And number three, there's UCL reconstruction. That's the Tommy John surgery where a brand new ligament is placed in because the ligament is of poor quality and cannot be repaired. Now in terms of the rehab steps, the first six weeks are generally about protecting the repair. That means usually wearing a brace or some sort of splint and working on controlling pain, swelling, and regaining range of motion. By six weeks, if both athletes have regained their range of motion, then it's about strengthening with the goal to begin throwing at three months. Now along the way, there has to be good control of pain and swelling, and that motion needs to be maintained so that throwing can be started. And typically, this is a throwing program. Athletes aren't going out and throwing 40, 50 yards right away. They begin a slow, gradual ramp up with the hope that at six months, athletes can return to full play and take contact. Most of the studies in the literature for UCL repair show high success rates, almost in the 80, 90% range, but typically return somewhere around six to seven months. The key thing, which we'll all watch as we go along, is that a lot of UCL repair data is done in pitchers. We don't necessarily know how this UCL repair will hold up in contact athletes, but the data is good in terms of throwing motion and elbow stability for UCL repair. Thank you.